You don't hear about mumps outbreaks too often thanks to vaccinations, but right now, five LSU students have mumps. So how common are mumps cases and what do you need to know? Mumps is a contagious viral infection spreading through saliva or mucus. It typically starts with a few days of fever, headache, muscle aches, weakness, and loss of appetite. Most people will have a red rash on their face and what mumps is best known for is causing puffy cheeks and a swollen jaw. You don't hear much about it anymore since there has been a 99% decrease in mumps cases in the U.S. since the vaccine first became available in 1967. Now, the vaccine is usually given in combination with measles and rubella. It's called the MMR vaccine. According to the CDC, two doses of mumps vaccine are 88% effective, and it's recommended children have both doses before they start school. LSU students are required to be vaccinated except for very, very few exceptions for medical or personal reasons. But the Centers for Disease Control says even if you've had the vaccine, you can still get mumps. Doctors aren't sure why, but it could be that some immune systems don't respond as well. Bottom line, if you haven't received two doses of the MMR vaccine, doctors would recommend getting it as soon as possible. And you can always get a third vaccine if you've come in contact with someone currently diagnosed with mumps. Erica Ferrando, Eyewitness News.